Hey guys, it's Mitchie, and I know I haven't made a video in a while, but I have uploaded a few recently. And first of all, I want to say excuse the appearance because it is like 11. Oh. Uh, yeah, it's like 11.30. It's almost midnight. So, yeah. And today is, um, I believe, prep. Hold on a second. The 28th, so it's about to be the 29th of June 2014, and I decided to make a video because, I don't know, I need an update, whoever's going to watch this. Hoping to get a lot of videos in here, maybe catch somebody's eye, grow an audience, you know, the whole YouTube dream. Anyway, so I haven't talked to you guys. Well, I uh, uploaded a video the other day from an update from April, and it is now July, so a lot has happened since then. Um, in that last video, let's go with my hair first. Um, I had the, I had my extensions still, and I had, um like a black brownish hair and then I had blue in my bangs. Anyway, since then, um, I, the color faded a lot and it turned to like a really weird brown and green mixture with the blue. So, uh, sorry if I'm like, like looking over here, it's cause there's a mirror right there. So yeah. And sorry if the camera's tilted, it kind of made some kind of weird camera setup. I mean, I'm recording this on my phone, so yeah anyway it was really hard to get it like this so basically since then I it faded like that so then I left my extensions in actually and I dyed half of my hair so this half of my hair perfectly down the street in the middle I dyed it black and then this side I bleached and dyed turquoise then the um oh geez <laughs> I'm trying to remember my hair story anyway the turquoise faded awkwardly, and I really didn't like the color I used. Um, Beyond the Zone, uh, what's it called? Something turquoise. Shh, kitty. Oh, I have my kitty. She's been in other videos. Anyway, so I used Beyond the Zone, something turquoise. I'm sorry, I don't remember the name of it. But then that kind of faded, and yeah, I didn't really like it. So then I, um, I took out my extensions, and I bleached the turquoise, and then it was, like, a perfect shade of, like, platinum blonde. So I had a half black and half blonde. And then my extensions, slowly the hair started getting ripped out of them. It was really bad. They were getting really nasty. So when I just took them out, and my hair had actually gotten pretty long. It was, like, down to about here or so. So, um, when I made a ponytail, it would come from, like, here to, like, here. So, it, it had grown quite a bit. So, basically, I had my hair like that, and then I decided to, um, bleach the black, and then I dyed the black half blue, not this blue, um, I used splat blue envy, and then I dyed the... This side of my hair red and the color was splat. I'm gonna say this wrong. Luxurious or whatever, raspberries. Anyway, um, the reason I was looking over there is because I have the box covers on my wall. Yeah, I changed my room a lot. As you can tell from the background, I took down my closet and my dresser, so my room's bigger. Anyway, so then after that, I, um, I had gotten some new extensions and actually I still have them. Let me go get them. Anyway, I bought these extensions. Oh, jeez, they're falling out of the package. These extensions from Sally Beauty Supply and they were around $35.00. And they're a mixture, they're a blend of human and synthetic hair. So when I dyed them, 
I don't know if you can really tell, but because I've kind of removed some of the color with some soap and stuff since then, but if you were to look really close and in better lighting, you could tell that the um, human hair died perfectly to the color and the synthetic did not take to the color at all. It was like pure white. So it did not look very good. I will put a picture one of when I had my hair like that in my uh, hair evolution video when I update that, which should be pretty soon. As soon as I get my hands on a laptop because I still have not gotten a laptop, which really sucks. Anyway, long story, not going to go into it. Hopefully I'll get one soon. Um, well, I have one. It's just it needs a system put in it. Not writing system. Anyway, um, back to my hair. So then I... Um, I bleached it. The half blue and half red. Because I was going to keep it like that for the whole of July, but then my sentences didn't go right. So then I decided I wanted to go blonde. So I bleached it. And then the color was all wacky. It was like um, blonde over here, then the random streak of like blue right here. The red did not come out very well. It looked like a really faded, ugly red. So then I um, took some splat hair dye and I mixed it with a bunch of conditioner. Um, I used uh, Blue Envy and um, the other one was purple. Uh, uh, the splat purple, I'm trying to remember. Purple Desire, that's what it was. And I mixed that together with a bunch of conditioner and then I put it in my hair and left it in for about maybe, I don't know, I want to say five to ten minutes. And then I rinsed it out and then it was kind of lavendery and just a bunch of random colors. My roots were blonde and it was bad. Anyway, I left that like that for a couple days and then I made the mistake of going and getting or going and bleaching it again. And this time I went to Sally's and I got um, a bleach powder developer. My phone is actually sitting on the um, bleach powder, along a bunch of other crap. Anyway, um, I got the Cal, I don't know, I'm just gonna spell it out though. C-A-L-E-I-D-O-C-O-L-O-R-S like Collodio colors or something like that. It's by Clairol and it's a tonal powder lightener and I got it in blue. And then I got the Salon Care 30 volume cream developer. So I mixed those together as instructed and I put it in my hair and I left it in there for maybe like by for like 10 or 15 minutes. It, my hair one my hair bleach is like really good. Sorry about that. My little structure just failed. So anyway. Um Yeah. So basically I left that in my hair for like fifteen minutes. And then it turned blonde. Even still now, the shades on this half and this half aren't still the same because of the black and then I had the lighter color on the other side. So even till now, the shades are like, oh, by the way, here's the bleach powder. I'll just turn the camera around. Bleach powder. So it's like Calodio Colors by Clairol. Anyway, so I mixed those two together and... It, um, was weird. And then I was, and then I was going to go, um, pastel purple or lavender or lilac, whatever you want to call it. So then I, when I was at Sally's and I got the bleach, I got this Enrage hair color in purple plum. And then when I got it here and I was starting to mix up the dye, I realized that the purple plum was actually really more of a blue purple. It was basically blue. That's actually what I have in my hair now. But it's... I, I added credit shirt to this one. Um, anyway. So then, luckily, I still had some of my Purple Desire by Splat. So I mixed most... Pretty... It's pretty much... Um, it was pretty much that color. Which I will show you in my hair evolution video. But, um... I did it when my hair was still kind of wet. So it didn't turn out really well. It was kind of patchy. 
So then when I redid it, I added more of the dye so it would be more pigmented and my hair was completely dry this time. So then it turned like to a darker purple, but it still wasn't like really dark because it still had a lot of conditioner in it. So then I washed it and then it finally painted to lavender. And then my hair was completely dead and it still is pretty dead and dry and gross. So I'm kind of just keeping it up and we're trying to keep away from these damaging heat tools and damaging bleach. So basically um, yesterday or last night I mixed together a bunch of conditioners, leaving conditioners, deep conditioners, hair oils, anything I could find that is good for your hair, treatments and whatnot. And then I mixed them together with the Enrage Purple Plum. And then I left it in my hair all night, I want to say for about maybe 15 hours or so. And then I rinsed it out this morning, and it was this color. So it looks more blue on camera, but I promise you it is actually... Oh, there. That pretty much picks up the color. Anyway, so that's the color of my hair now, and I'll probably just keep get some more deep conditioners and stuff that's good for your hair and keep it like this and not use the hair tools heat tools for a while until my hair starts to grow out and get healthy again it's gonna kill me but it's summer so I don't mind keep and school's out for the summer so I don't mind keeping my hair up but um if I get if I get into the money I'm gonna see if my mom can get me some new extensions and then I'm gonna dye them this blue Maybe make this a bit darker, and then I'm going to dye the ends of the extension red and the tab the rest of them blue for the 4th of July. Hopefully I'll get that for the 4th of July. So anyway, that is my hair story and what has been going on with that. Oh, also I had to cut it, and now it is about shoulder length. So, not fun. It was like falling out from the bleach. It was terrible. So don't over bleach your hair, guys, because it will kill your hair, then you'll be sad. Like I am. Anyway. So, um, basically that's what's been going on with my hair. And I've been getting really better at my makeup. I got some new makeup. If you want me to do a tutorial on that, any kind of makeup, whatever, foundation, routine, all that crap, I will just leave a comment or like this video. I don't know. Anyway, just leave in the comments videos that you want me to do because I need some video ideas. I should be making more videos soon. My friend from Rochelle, her name is uh, Jess. She's been in my previous videos. She had black hair. Anyway, um, she should be visiting me sometime within the next, about a little over a week. And she'll be staying for like a week and a half, maybe two weeks here. And so I'll try to make, I'll try to make some videos with her while she's here. Because we'll probably be out a lot and doing a lot of crap. Anyway, so, um, yeah. And this video is probably getting really long, so I think I'm going to make this maybe a two, three part thing. So this is part one of my hair. So I will talk to you guys in, the, in part two of my update. Um, explaining maybe what's been going on or, yeah. So, anyway. We will see you in part two, and this video is probably getting really long. It's going to take forever to upload, so I will talk to you in part two. Bye, guys.